My name is Ashley from Barking Dogs Walkery and welcome to the Walkery Ranch. Our place is a half acre located in Los Angeles, California, where we offer daycare, overnight doggy boarding, and training. In this video, I wanted to give you guys a few tips on housebreaking your new dog. So dogs can learn to be potty trained about seven to eight weeks old. Uh, actually, when the mother has babies in their den in the wild, they remove all the waste from there. So puppies naturally learn not to go where they live or where they sleep. So this is a natural thing for dogs. It's something that can be taught and hopefully very quickly if you're persistent. So when you bring your new dog home, your puppy or your older dog, you wanna make sure to take them outside or wherever your desired place is for them to go. So whether it's a puppy pad or maybe outside in a corner, walk them to that spot. They may not go, but you wanna get them familiar with that spot. Make sure to check out our first video on bringing home a new dog. You wanna make sure to follow all those rules because that's gonna help you with potty training. So once you do that, if it's a puppy, you're going to want to take them out every hour. I know, it's just like having a new baby, a newborn, they keep you up all day, all night. But you want to make sure to be consistent with this because this is going to help you in the long run. So the more consistent you are and the better the dog gets at this, the longer the time frame is in between potty breaks. So you might be able to extend the hour into an hour and a half or two hours around then. If your dog has an accident in the house, you want to make sure not to discipline them like after the fact, it's they live in the moment. So if you catch them in the act, you wanna pick them up and try to take them out to that desired spot, wherever it is. They're learning, it does take a while, but it takes consistent, so stay patient. So the more consistent you are at this, the better they're gonna get it. They're gonna get the hang of it. It takes a while, just takes patience. So the longer the breaks in between, that time is. So instead of taking them out every hour, you may be able to take them out every hour and a half, every two hours. If they happen to have a, an accident, don't discipline them right in the act. You now know that your dog maybe can't wait the two hours. You might have to take them out every hour and a half or so, but this time interval will get longer and longer. Another thing to remember is that after your dog eats, sleeps, or plays, they're most likely gonna wanna use the restroom. So just try working on that. After a meal time, straight out to that desired location. After they play, and after they sleep.